But I am Ryan Smith, and today we'll be reviewing the Samore battery powered leaf blower. The only table that everything it comes with. Here, shoulder strap, which I personally didn't use because the incredibly lightweight with the battery on it is 4.3 pounds. With this, it's probably two. Those are safety goggles. Wearing these out at night just because they're hot. It's under the gray quickly for you. This goes under the gray batch. This, of course, is our main nozzle. Direct the air through the smaller, flatter opening with precision so you can go along the ground. Ooh. You can see over here, larger. I have a pre-charge these batteries. Right, you can check out the right side of your screen. You will see your charger with a red light while battery's charging. The green light indicates fully charged. All right, let's power on. It'll actually leave it on without having to hold trigger for variable speed. This on top, this turbo gives you an extra boost. Now, it has a 4 and uh, 20 volt lithium battery. It comes with an extra. This is important. Before you start your project, make sure both are fully charged and get ready for about a 15 to 20 minute battery cycle. All you're going to get, especially if uh, you had my experience when you were using the turbo a lot. Come in, put the fully charged battery on, take the dead battery off, put it in the charger, this, flip it on. When the red light goes on, that means it's charging. So you got 15 minutes with the fresh one, and when that dies, pull the one charging off and put this one on until you're done. My lead will be fine. I just want to uh, say that the lightweight path is great. I did a quarter acre yard that is in a forest completely covered. I did about a 40 foot by 30 foot section in under an hour. Cleared all the leaves and put them out the back of the fence. It was, it was um, more than adequate for a non-commercial use at home. And it's so light and we saw how small it is, it breaks down the size of a dust buster. It is easy to put away for the season. I like that. Um, it can handle uh, wet leaves fine. It doesn't have a great drying power. It shouldn't be an issue. It's just for moving leaves. It's great and the value is great. So I really like this product. I gave this a four star. That wraps up our review. I have been Ryan Smith for Powerhouse.